Hello friends, it is time for another Costco shopping trip. We end up here about once a week, every seven to 10 days, so not too surprising. We need veggies, we need milk. We're gonna shop. This little guy wants what? Chocolate milk. Chocolate milk. I have to say, people that say that they go Costco shopping once a month, and then that's like all the shopping they do, I don't understand it because I go once a week and my refrigerator is like overflowing. Tell me the secrets to shopping once a month. Hi, Alaska boy. I like your shirt. What if you, what if you go to Costco every day? Every day, that would be a lot. I think you would be broke because you'd spend all your money. Yeah. All right, I ended up these. The stitching in them is so uncomfortable. Tried it on, immediately took it off. Plus, I didn't see the removable cups. I feel like anything that says removable cup is worthless. All right, we're up at the front. They've got these apple trees for $19.99. We actually bought two last year. I don't think they survived. These ones are actually like looming. Look. It's a good deal, but they're just like a bare root. They don't have a good solid base. Oh, they've got an electric lawn mower for $529. That has batteries. It does have batteries. Oh, they've got lots of skincare stuff on sale this week. All these are on sale. Oh, they've got a new sunscreen on sale. Got all the health and body stuff, band-aids on sale for $8.99. I feel like I just bought some, but never seemed to be enough. We'll put that in our storage. Mom, look. Ooh, this looks fun. A suds and spray car wash like set, $24.99. That's actually good for cleaning. Yeah, it would be good for cleaning. <laughs> that too. Oh, this too. Double shot suds and rinse. <laughs> Looks like you could have like a professional car wash. <laughs> uh, cleaning stuff is all cleaning stuff. Now we have turtle wax. Now that. Oh, and microfiber towels. Ah. Oh wow, this thing is new. A one-gallon jug. That looks like way more than a gallon. Holds 17 cups. Uh. Hot or cold. Maybe that's what we should get dad. <laughs> Holy cow, that could hold a lot of hot chocolate. Yeah. yeah it's huge. I can barely hold it. Interesting. Big. Big, I want it. Wait, Wait, that on. We'll, we'll think about it. We'll put it in our cart. But we'll... Wait, I would like to have. chocolate milk for hot chocolate. Oh, here they have a pro vacuum sealer for $249. And it's a, called a Weston brand. Do we need a Weston vacuum sealer? That sounds like Weston. <laughs> it does. Family's oh, they've got West. the digital scale on sale for $12.99. I actually buckled myself up. You did. Oh, I... It's not plugged in. I want to pull that lever. No, that's just how you, that's how you move it up or down. I want to do it backwards. Up, 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 up and then okay I'm locking it in place you put a type of over there you can make a little pool for for bugs a little pool for bugs up in there yeah that's interesting okay bugs do die in water they do die in water so are you making them a swimming pool or a trap a trap okay for the ones that hate that love blood Oh, for the mosquitoes. Get rid of them. Get rid of them from you need But they blood. also lay their eggs in water, so that's not good because then you get more baby mosquitoes. Uh-oh. So I'm not making a trap. Ooh, this is new. An expandable mesh colander for over your sink. That looks kind of nice. $18.99. Wait, what? There's a number on your... That's a letter. What? Do you know what letter that is? I don't know. L. L. For? What do you think mommy would wear an L for? No, I don't know. Hmm. Oh, what starts with O? I don't know. Hmm, okay. 
Marriage? Marriage? Mm -hmm. Nope. Necklace? Oh. Uh. What's mommy's name? Uh. Uh. Mom. <laughs> my name is Mom, but what's my real name? Ham. That's my last name. That would be a <gasps> ham. Oh. Lauren. Lauren. It's an <laughs> L for Lauren. He's talking about my necklace here. On the back it says, one in a million. <laughs> Do you think I'm one in a million? Oh, uh, That old? means you're, spe <laughs> doesn't mean you're old, it means you're special. You're one in a million. Old, special? Special. Oh, they've got a taco set. Comes with a tortilla warmer and taco holders and then things for your toppings. That's kind of fun. 1949 and they're plastic so they'd be perfect for like out on the deck. I love stuff like that. I think it's so cute but storing them in between is just I don't like to store a lot of stuff like that. Good thing that I'm not glass. Yeah. When we're camping and doing a lot of things in the summer, I pretty much live in Costco joggers. So for $9.99, grabbing a new pair. Uh -oh. You live in them? I live in them. You always wear them? No, I don't think we need that aisle, but I'm still looking for the bags, the moose bags. Maybe they'll have them today. They seem to have a lot of new stuff. Ooh. Smell that? <laughs> Something smells good. What do you think it is? It sample. Sample? Mm. Oh, here's a look. There's a fan blowing my hair. <laughs> what about this one? Are you getting blown? I keep blown. That one's too high up. Here, I'll hold you if you want to get up carefully. <laughs> it's going up. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Good. That was fun. The fan. I said, that was fun to see enough out the fun. <laughs> that was fun testing out the fun. <laughs> that was fun testing out the fun or the fan? Fun. Oh, I don't know if I've ever seen these rechargeable batteries here. $16.99 on sale. Hmm. Saw them in at. These? Those are very dangerous for kids because they if you swallowed one, what? They will eat a hole in your stomach. And you have to go to the hospital, so you have to be really careful. You need to give it a hug? Okay. Mm. Does it feel better? You're gonna hug me the whole way. Yeah. How am I gonna grab my groceries? <laughs> How am I gonna grab my groceries <laughs> if I, you hug me the whole way? Let's just do one big long hug. Okay. 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 I need you to let me go now. No. No. Yeah, we gotta look at stuff. Sample, sample fun. Smells like chicken over here. Multigrain. Oh, we'll try these. Multigrain have three grams of fiber. That's good. For five thirty-nine. For twelve. And these are four ninety-nine. Kids love these. They love making pizzas on them. They like. Wait, you can actually make pizza on them. Yep. I need some chocolate milk. Dinos. Put these for Mark. Mom, you remember that game at Chuck E. Cheese where was after killing the dinos in the Jurassic World? I do remember that. There was a nades. There were grenades? Yeah. Yeah. And I have chocolate. You have a chocolate grenade thrower? Yeah, and it can stitch you chocolate milk. Oh, that's good that it can sit right there. It's like a little, <laughs> you're turning our cart into a grenade launcher, huh? And it can chew chocolate milk. Okay. Chocolate milk. Oh, we're done. 6 
99. I've got these for a long time. Lay me out! Hey, it's just gonna be quick. You're already frozen? I'm already. That didn't take very long. You did, you went up my sleeve. Come off. Oh, those don't look very good. Slice, slice, slice. $2.79. The bananas. Everett says he wants crab legs, but they're $43.99 a pound. And then two bucks for that. 108. These Dungeness are $17.99 a pound. <laughs> Ooh, what are those? That is a seasoned rack of pork. $39 a pound. Look yummy. Oh, they've got a tortellini salad for $14. Look yummy. Cilantro lime shrimp, $14. This is always yummy. $11.52. Okay, hold on. Lemon. Those are the blueberry bread. Oh, blueberry bread. Okay, we'll wait for the donut. Did you want to try a lemon donut? Yes, please. What do you say? Thank you. Alright. Ooh, blueberry bread. Super yummy. What did you say? Now I'm from my soccer milk. Yum. You have to promise not to squirt it all over the countertop. Okay. Okay, let mom and dad help you or your brothers. Take a nap on a pillow of wrappers? Mm -hmm. What? That's kind of silly. I don't want to be like this. Oh. But I need a bear. All right, we ate this last week the cauliflower, Kirkland cauliflower pizza. I thought it was excellent. I liked the texture of the crust. Lemons. You love lemons? Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, and peanut butter's on sale. You always gotta stock up when peanut butter's on sale. Seven twenty-nine. Okay. Donut. Donut. Grab one of these too for eleven ninety-nine. Got some when we come back around. Let's see here they are. This in papers. Blueberry bread. So good. And then lemon donuts. Lemon donuts. You know what? We're going to have so many treats in the next couple days. I say let's just wait on that. Oh, I got some pools. That one's $47.99. Or this huge behemoth. Cool. For seven sixty nine. That's not empty for that. Oh, they have the GoPro ten now. 
Yeah. Oh, and it also comes with a battery charger. That's good. Get it, get it, get it. Oh, I'm not going to get it, but for $4.89. I want some of that food. I saw some of that lemon. Uh, some of that. Do I call lemony sweetie? Oh. So Costco lemon. has their fishing waders in, 99 99 and then these are the wading boots that you wear with them, and they are $64.99 unisex. Um, so in Alaska, you have to have hard bottom. You can't have felt bottom, so that's something to look for. Those look like a good deal. Oh, the boat changed colors. This is the little raft we have down at the cabin. $2.49, we need to call dad. Oh, and it doesn't have seats. It just has those little blow up things. I like the color of it. No, it, those are the seats. I know, but they don't have the hard seats like ours. Ours at the cabin last summer, a bear bit it. And so it has a hole in it. Mark patched it, but it's just never as good once you have to patch it. Now I've got a brand new one. I'm gonna send it to dad, see what he says. All right, they look up above you. Yeah. You want to sit in that? Yeah. You right wanna... now. <laughs> it is a hammock. Twenty-five ninety-nine. I actually want to stand in that. You want to stand in it? I think you'd probably fall and hit your head. No, I want it to slow it down right on the ground. Oh, they got some cute summer hats. Put it on you. It might look cute on you. I don't know about that. Let's see. Oh, so cute. It looks really cute. Oh, and it has this little thing and you go like this. Watch. It goes like that so it doesn't fall off. <laughs> it can actually fall off. It helps it to not fall off. Try these true fruit. Ooh, the chocolate covered strawberries. Oh no. Thank you. I wanted the little one. You want the little one? I bet I could grab you the little one. There you go. Thank you. I wanted to buy into it. A little bit sour in the middle, huh? I don't like the wet strawberry. That's the thing I don't like. You're right. It is a little bit wet and slimy in the middle, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh, these are always really mesmerizing. Oh, they've got, it's blowing up there. Do you see it? Mm -hmm. see if I can. Ooh. It must have a fan blowing on it, because that's cool. Oh, a big giant wind chime for $71.99. A lightweight kink resistant hose. That sounds nice, $44.99. The ultimate water blaster. That sounds dangerous with four boys. $18.99 connected to a hose. Use that instead of a water gun. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that would yeah. be intense. For a water bottle? Yeah. <laughs> and yep. Okay. For me, this right here is the ultimate sign that summer is about to come. What? The fruit bars are on sale. And the ice cream. The ice cream's not on sale, just the fruit no. bars. Oh. I have been loving this lately for my lunches. Ice cream bars. What chocolate covered ones? No, we didn't. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Key lime. Thank you. I hope it's not sour, plain. 
It's key lime flavored. Oh, Gogurt's are on sale. Get some for the freezer. You like the key lime? That is really good. Okay, how could you start that sentence other than I want? I can please have that. Yes, you may. Double spoons! I get double spoons. Now I get double spoons. The thing that he's eating is this key lime, and it's very delicious. Seems very sugary though. Oh, it's got the key lime at the bottom, and then the yogurt, and then the topping. It's like dessert. But yummy. Oh, they've got these again. These pineapple ones are amazing. A good sample day, isn't it? Uh-huh. All treats though. I'll cover pop like covered raisins. I mean strawberries. Chocolate covered strawberries, donuts, blueberry bread. So many things to try. Yeah. I can't try all of them. I wonder what this one's gonna be. Oh it's the tortillas. What? The ones that? we bought last time. <gasps> What? A little quesadilla. Uh -huh. This is on sale. I've never seen it on sale before. I'm waiting. For what? Just looking at stuff. It's just kind of busy over here right now. No, I'm just chasing that little girl. They are chasing her, aren't they? Oh, I've never seen that one. Baby bear, baby bear. What do you see? <laughs> we have the brown bear, brown bear, but we don't have the polar bear. Mm, no. Or the baby bear. I've never seen that one. A new book that's super cute huge book of numbers oh I just love the illustrations in this oh book of colors and animals oh this is a different one I've never seen these all these different Eric Carl books I've never seen what's your favorite color what's your favorite bug and what's your favorite animal I love it. And Everett loves what? Which book do you love? The superhero one, huh? He likes pushing all the buttons. Well, as I was changing my battery, we just met one of our subscribers. She said hello, and uh, so thanks for saying hi. This is your Alaska travel planner. Okay, buddy. You pushing all the buttons? I need to push I think I'm gonna put this back. It's just so huge. This is just so huge. I don't even know where we would store it. I know Everett's gonna be sad, but I just don't think we need it. Lots of little thermoses. He's still looking at his book. <laughs> so he didn't notice. <laughs> Guys, this doesn't seem like a very full cart today. What am I missing? Veggies, maybe. 
I didn't seem to have the veggies I wanted. No cauliflower. Oh uh, yeah. I never get to do all of these. I know, but you've you've gotten to do it a lot of times, so. Yes, I'm an empty nester, so it's nice to relive yeah. Hi. family and meal planning and outdoor Hi. activities. Hi. Hi. I'm Hi. Charlene. It was very nice to meet you. Now you're now you're ready to say hello. Bye. Oh. Again, thanks for saying hi. <laughs> I was saying hi. You were saying hi a bunch of times. Hi 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 hi. Hi hi. Oh my goodness. You make sure she knew you said hi, huh? Yeah. Ice cream. I want it. Give me, give me. Coffee. <laughs> <laughs> These are some local restaurants. I love this place called the Rustic Goat. If you visit Alaska, I would highly recommend it. Uh, this one's good too. This one's downtown. Fat Tarmigan's Pizza Place. Let's see if there's any more. Oh, here we go. This is called Glacier Brew House. This is also downtown. And this one right here, Simon and Seifert's, is a really nice downtown restaurant. Oh, are you getting us some... It is Daddy and I's anniversary here soon, but we're not gonna get those. I'm getting them for that. What they need is to get some for that. Um, what? For the Wild Scoops ice cream, don't they? If they had that, I'd be snatching it up. Yeah. Because that was so yummy. It were? Oh, Remember what? when we went on our date? Oh yeah. And we went and got ice cream and you had, what kind did you have, do you remember? <gasps> Lucky Charms. Oh yeah, oh yeah. And I had the caramel and it was so good. I'm gonna run down and have that. Oh, these, I haven't seen pears here for a while. These are good for food storage. Yeah, you get two. Kind of spendy, but they're Did good. Good if we don't have fresh fruit. I, what? If there was a caramel here, caramel candy here, I'll, be one of those on one of those things. I'll be snatching it up. Okay. All right. Do they have any olives this week? Hope some do. Olives, where are you? Unbuckle this, mom, please. Sure. Oh, can you please unbuckle this? Yes. Thank you for asking. So nicely. It's been so good for just making little pizzas, but also for throwing on my salads. I'm gonna grab what? some more. I put my salad? And they freeze well. Yeah, I like putting them on my um, salad. My salad, yeah. What kind of salad? My Greek salad. What a Greek salad! My Greek salad. It's so good. But they need to have. Oh. <gasps> what? What? Yes. Oh look, they only have a tiny bit on top of all these. You guys, the little jar I bought at Walmart was like more than this. Oh, I'm trying to make my belly big. Trying to make your belly big? Yeah, I did want to. What are these? Oh, this cough cookies are on sale. Get the I want to make a dessert out of these. I have to look it up from Amber's Kitchen. I can't remember exactly what it is, but I remember it looked so good. Oh. I made these on Sunday with a bunch of nuts in them and they were so good. They're just make it so easy to make good brownies. But we'll restock. That's it. I'm killing stuff. You're killing stuff? I'm killing the food. Okay, let's not, you don't want to smush all the bread, so be careful. Okay. Get this off. You'd like it moved? So say, can you move this please? Mom, you can put this way on top of the olives. Sure. Yep. On top of them. That's a good spot for them. On top of the olives. Oh, oh here's where they move the melatonin. So this one is five milligrams. That one is one, but they're the same price. So really we could just cut these in half and then with how much sunshine we're having right now, we have that's become very important for the summertime. Okay. Especially when we're camping. Especially when we're camping. Someone suggested that these are really good. 
I don't like eating protein bars very often, but sometimes when I just need to run out the door. So these ones are cookies and cream, chocolate peanut butter chunk, chocolate chip cookie dough, and chocolate brownie. And they're $18.99, making them 95 cents a piece. Hmm. Just gonna have them as like a backup thing. I'm really trying to make sure that I get what are you doing? I'm just trying to talk. I just want to be like Okay. I'm just trying to make sure that I get a ton of veggies in, not just protein. So that's why sometimes <laughs> grabbing a bar Mom, just back, feels like a back, treat rather back, than eating back, a lot of good vegetables. Back, back. back up. Why? Beep, beep, beep. Oh, you want another one? Well, maybe these would be good too. 10 grams of protein. They're only 33 cents a bar. Um, those are protein bars. Those are Z-bars. My protein? If they go on sale this summer, we will <gasps> grab some for our oh. hiking and biking and playing at the park. Yeah. Chocolate. Grab some of these for my salad with my beets. $9.99. Oh my God. Chocolate milk. We've got the chocolate to make chocolate milk, remember? Oh, uh, where is it? Where it's, is it? It's hiding in there, I promise. Oh, this looks new. I've never seen this. Peanut butter chocolate mix. Even I want this nighttime vitamins. If you eat the nighttime vitamins, you're going to fall asleep. <laughs> you're going to be like, and then... You're going to fall asleep right in the middle of a sentence if you ate a bottle of melatonin. You'd be so sick. Yeah. You'd sleep for a week. What's the rule with that? Eat all of it. No, what's the real <laughs> rule about anything medicine or vitamins? Don't, don't eat it all. But what's the rule about it in our house? Only eat two or one. Who has to give it to you? Mom and dad. Yes, that's the rule. <laughs> Do you want to take our picture in front of the underwear? No! <laughs> Oh, it's on clearance. It's going away. 97 cents. Yep, we'll grab some more. To, oh, no, that's bubble bath. It's still $15.99. It's okay. We'll wait for it to go on sale. We still have a couple. Bubble bath is all right. The champ and more than soap making bubble. Mm. Bubble bath the world. Bubble bath the world. <laughs> Oh my goodness. <laughs> I didn't want to just say that. I can tell. I grab these for the kids' teachers. Ooh, $8.99. Cuter. Haul for the day. See how much it, it is. Actually, bubble bath just gives you a bath with bubbles. Okay. Can you help me? You're such a good helper. Thank you. I like this. Shut up. Shut up. All right, Everett had his chicken bake. I had some of my salad. We made it out. Uh, I think today's cart was deceiving because I had so much on the bottom. I was thinking it was going to be cheaper. Let's head home. I'll show you the haul and tell you the total. What are you doing in there? Checking out these. Oh, can you show us what you made at preschool? Eggs! An Easter egg! So pretty. You painted that? I had to. Mom, I want to paint a little more. Okay, can you move so I can put this chair down, please? All right. Oh, Everett. Oh, I don't know if I can lift this. It's full of rocks. Ever collected rocks. Oh, <laughs> it's so heavy. It's <laughs> so heavy. It takes a little more time here at the car, but it's sure nice when I get to the house. And it's so heavy. Oh my goodness, look at that huge rock. Yeah. Look What's that me. doing in your lunchbox? Yeah. All right, I'd say that's a full load. All right, I just finished getting all the groceries out of the car. Sometimes I wonder why 
it takes so long to go Costco shopping. It's currently 3.15. I picked up Everett at noon. We went straight to Costco. So we're gonna be like three and a half hours into this by the time I get all the groceries upstairs. Whew, no wonder I have to like pump myself up to go. Let's get this stuff upstairs. All right, I'm gonna go put these out in the shed. If I leave them out, they get eaten so quickly. So I'm gonna go put these out in the freezer so you're not gonna see these in the hall. Hi. Hi. I couldn't jump down because this box was in the way. Can you make sure you grab a bag and you pick it up with me, please? Hello, Miss Luna. That was a second workout, bringing everything up. All right, time to check out the Costco haul. I got milk this week. We actually just ran out this morning. We went through milk kind of slow over the last couple weeks. I don't know what that was about, but grabbed some of that. Two Go-Gurts because they were on sale. One will go in the freezer. Grab some ham. I've been loving having ham and salads. Um, grab some of, oh, Luna's here to investigate. Hi, kitty. Yeah, nothing for you here, but that's okay. You're still welcome to say hello. All right, um, I've heard that this is the best butter for you because it's from grass-fed cows and it was on sale. I've never seen it on sale before, so I grabbed two of those. This, I've been going through one of these a week. So good, I love the variety. And then I'll throw some of these in there to make it go longer. Been going through all three cucumbers in a week. You guys, I've just been making the best salads. I'm thinking I need to make just a video of all the yummy salads. I'm making tomatoes, more mini peppers. I still have some big peppers from last week, but um, I've been going through the mini peppers super quick. And mandarin oranges, bananas, eggs, pitas. Might figure out something to do with those for dinner tonight. Sandwich rolls. Mark's going to be having some hot dogs here in a couple days, so he'll need those. And some multi-grain English muffins. Um, nine grain bread for the boys and Mark. Some pepperonis. Hershey's syrup. We have not gotten that in a long time, but my dad's gonna be here soon and he loves her cheese syrup. And Everett loves it, so we just have to keep him from, you know, live, trying to live off of it. Um, peanut butter, we stocked up. I thought I got three of them. There may be one more in the car, but maybe I only end up grabbing two. When it's on sale, I try and stock up on that. We always make sure we write the date on it and put it in the back of the food storage so that we use them um, oldest first. Grab the boys some more fruit leathers, which I need to just thaw out some raspberries and make some fruit leather, but that doesn't last very long when I make it, maybe a day or two. And I did end up getting four of these Kalamata olives because a tiny bottle was the same price at Walmart. It's just such a good deal. These will go in food storage and I will be one happy lady to have them. Uh, shrimp, easy to just saute or put in the air fryer and eat with my lunch or for dinner. Um, I am not on keto at all, but um, I do have a really good beet salad that uses, um, that uses spiced pecans. These seem like they could be better for you than the um, sugary ones. So I'll give a review. I'll try one right now, actually. We'll see how it tastes. Two grams of protein, healthy fats, no sugar added, gluten-free. One net carb, so it's got eight total carbs and two grams of fiber, five grams of sugar alcohol, which gives it one net carb. Hmm. It'd be good on a salad. They're just like, they're just slightly, slightly sweet. Pecans, erythrol, butter, cinnamon, salt, monk fruit. I'm excited to try them on a the salad. 
grab some more of these quepasa chips, jalapeno and lime. Such a good little flavor to them. Uh, grab this for my lunch, ate a bunch of it. I feel like they packed so much spinach in there. Honestly, if I gave it a good shake, it probably would look like I hadn't even eaten any. And I ate as much as I wanted to eat, so <laughs> we'll have that for dinner tonight too. Stocked up on these cans of pears. We try to not eat canned fruit very often unless we're camping um, or we can't get real fruit. That's more what we buy it for, but we don't want it to go bad either. It does have a shelf life. So every once in a while, we'll have it as a treat. Protein bars. Last Costco haul, I grabbed these protein bars. They have to be kept in the um, refrigerator. My Costco does not carry these. But they're amazing so I will grab them if I'm ever at the other Costco again you can see it all sometimes just grab half of one and take it with me if I know I'm not gonna eat like today when I was heading to Costco and I knew it was gonna be a couple hours before I got to have my salad I didn't have time to eat lunch before I left because I had to go pick up Everett from the babysitter and it just was like oh I'm just gonna take half one of these that way I wasn't like so hungry that I just like pigged out on pizza and stuff so grab some more maple syrup my favorite Asian dressing is made with maple syrup, so gotta make sure I have this on hand. Grab these Biscoff cookies. I'm gonna try a recipe with them. I can't remember what, exactly what it was, but it looked so yummy on Amber's kitchen. And then some Ghirardelli chocolate brownies. All right, here's the table of things I didn't really know I was gonna get today, but Band-Aids, because you always need Band-Aids with kids. That'll go in the emergency storage. These. I tried the lemon one at someone's house and it smelled so stinking good, but I love having these on hand to give as gifts. Grabbed a pair of joggers. There's the inspector. Mm -hmm. Three more melatonin because summertime, sometimes it's hard for kids to finally realize it's nighttime and go to sleep. And I picked these up, these pineapple spindrift on a whim a couple weeks ago. They're amazing. If you like Spindrift, I think this is their best one. It really does taste like pineapple. All right, let's find my receipt and do the total. Not the receipt. Not the receipt. You tell us the total. How much did we spend today? <laughs> like, leave me alone. Remember, in addition to this haul, I did take out two boxes of popsicles that just needed to get in the freezer because they were gonna start melting. It's been a long time since I grabbed those. Um, our total was $428.37. Another big haul. I I'm not sure how we go through this much food. We didn't even get that much fruit this week because our fruit bowls over here still have quite a bit in them. So I don't feel like I even stocked up on fruit, but we stocked up on a lot of other things. I gotta remember that. We stocked up on peanut butter, olives, gogurt, some canned fruit. We got some good food storage stuff, which is always important to me. Every once in a while, I will go and do like a big food storage haul. But I think it's actually better to just pick up a little bit here and there. It just seems like it's better for our bank account if I just take get a little bit at a time and then we have what we need. So no panic buying, no rushing shelves and you know hoarding things. I just like to have a steady little stream of extra food that we can use in an emergency, can use if we can't get to the store. And if there is a bigger emergency like an earthquake or something, we will be okay. Thank you so much for being here with me and thanks for going shopping with me and Everett. We really appreciate all of you. We hope that you have a wonderful day. You are amazing and wonderful and we're so grateful for you and we'll see you again real soon for more of this Alaska life. What are you going after, Luna? What's up there? She sees whatever that is up on the ceiling. Look at Luna. She, are you trying to get it? Shining off the water in the sink. Up to the ceiling up there. Very interested in what that is.